Spotted lanternfly continues to be a problem for homeowners and ag businesses in parts of Pennsylvania. So much so that soon business will need a permit to travel into quarantined areas. Irvin Hinckley is following the story. He joins us live from our State College studio. So, Evan, tell us more about these requirements now. Well, Amanda, those permits will allow you to enter in areas such as the quarantine zone, the area in blue that you see behind me here. But to receive that permit, employees will need to be educated on how the fly can spread. They'll lay their egg cases on essentially anything. Penn State researchers in the Department of Entomology say that ranges from wood to plastic, including the wheel wells of cars. This insect can move at any life stage. And so the eggs cases are really um, at high risk for spread because then you're spreading as many as 60 insects with one egg case. They tend to lay, you know, they all tend to lay um, in similar places so you can move more. Local businesses that travel frequently to the quarantine zone, like Fullington Bus Company, are requiring all their employees to get training, not only on how the lanternfly can spread, but how to check to make sure there are no freeloading flies. When they complete the training, their vehicles will receive this orange permit. And the deadline to complete that training before those, that permit that you saw there is enforced is May 1st. Now, coming up at 6, I'll explain how the State Department of Agriculture plans to enforce their permitting policy. But for now, reporting live here in the State College studio, Evan Hinckley, WTAJ News.